Uh, good afternoon. We're out here today with sophomore Danielle Kitchener. Danielle, how are you? I'm good. How are you? Good, thanks. So you have your last two games of the season tomorrow at Penn College on the road for a final try match with Penn College and Penn State Abington. So kind of just talk about what you guys are looking forward to for tomorrow. Um, so yeah, our last two matches are this weekend and we're finishing up with Penn State Abington, which is actually one of our first people that we played. So it's kind of going full circle and we're looking to get our 22 wins, which is going to be the most wins of school history since 2005 mm -hmm. and also will be the seventh most winning team in school history. So that'll be a nice little thing if we get 22 wins. Definitely. And like you said, you guys played Penn State Abington to start the season. So kind of just talk about what you guys are going to try to do. Um, to make sure you get the win against them this time, especially after they've played a full season and so have you guys. Yeah, definitely. Um, we They've definitely grown a lot because you said it, We they've played a full season, but we've also grown a lot too. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to come out and play our strongest and try to beat them by more than what we beat them the first time around and show that we really did improve and that like our whole entire team has improved so much and we're just ready to come out and show them that. That's awesome. And then, like you said, you guys hit 20 wins earlier um, about two weeks ago. And then if you win both things this weekend, it'll be the most since 2005. So kind of just talk about what that means as a team um, to go through a full season, get all those wins, and just bring that um, recognition back to King's College. Um, definitely. It's amazing because most of the schools are looking at us because we're just sophomore and freshmen. We have no upperclassmen. So it was definitely a huge thing to hit the 20 win mark because a lot of people said we couldn't do it. So if we push to get these 22 wins, it's going to be even sweeter just to prove them wrong. So. And like you said, last question, sorry. Um, you are just all a bunch of freshmen and sophomores, so you're all going to be coming back next year most likely. So just kind of talk about what that means, what kind of momentum that's going to bring um, getting this milestone and going into next season with a slightly more veteran team. Um, definitely. Because we are so young, we do have a longer time to create more of a team chemistry, which it, it showed from this season, from last year with all the freshmen coming back. Um, so we're just going to take this off season, rest, recover, come back in for spring season, work super hard so that way when we come back for this next season, we're going to learn from our mistakes this season and we're going to put all of our hard work in chemistry and we're like our own little family so we all have each other's back so we're just going to push harder and get more wins hopefully next season. Perfect. That's all the time we have for today. Thank you, Danielle. Thanks.